Hey y'all, coming to you from the international headquarters of Scotty D TV. But I was out at the 2021 SEMA show. And one of the things I'm most excited about the SEMA show this year was this 1948 Chevrolet pickup truck. Now it's a good looking truck. I dig the color, the interior's nice, the wheel's nice. But the biggest thing about this is it was not electric, but yet it was zero emission. It was hydrogen power, and I'm very excited about that. Let me get the camera turned around. Let's check this thing out. Before I get started, if you don't mind, let me give a big shout out to the uh, SEMA Media Center, especially uh, Juan and Lori for taking such good care of Scotty DTV, trying to get me everything I need so that I can get you these cool videos. So again, big shout out. Thanks so much. And not to just them, but everybody else that works hard in that, that Media Center too. One of the best on the planet for sure. So now, let me tell you how excited I am about this 1948 Chevrolet 3100. Okay, because if you weren't at SEMA, you wouldn't know, but electric was all the rage. People were losing their mind, you know, I don't get it. Take a Hemi out and put a box with some wires and some lights in it under the hood, and all of a sudden, oh, look at that, how cool is that? Not cool at all. And, you know, I mean, that's my feelings on electric. I'm not a big fan of it. I like the combustion engine, and I like how it sounds. I like how it performs. I like what it does. I just like it. And so I'm not down with electricity, but I'm not all about, you know, carbon monoxide and poisoning and that kind of stuff either. If we can eliminate that, then great, let's do it. And Arrington Performance had at the Redline Oil booth this 1948 Chevrolet pickup truck that was hydrogen powered. That's right. That's an LS 6.2 supercharged up underneath the hood. Everything's the same. Mike tells me you push the button, it starts, and you would not know the difference. Everybody in this building keeps their job. How cool is that? And what a beautiful truck. I mean, I just absolutely love the color of it. Red pearl is what they showed it as. Nice custom interior. 6.2, like I said, got a five-speed, Tremec five-speed, Mosier nine-inch rear end, three and a half gear ratio in the rear end. Just an absolutely beautiful truck. But above and beyond that, I'm excited because it's an alternative to electricity. And I rode in my first electric car in Vegas. I got a video coming on the tunnels and the Teslas that run in them underneath Vegas. It's, you know, for that it's cool. But for now, I've got this very cool 1948 Chevrolet 3100 from the 2021 SEMA show. It's running 19 by nines on the front and 20 by 12s on the back. I know you want to know that. And of course, it's running Continental 235 40ZR19s and 305 35ZR20. Extreme sport context, just as I run on my vehicles. I love them Continental tires. And I love this truck. More than it just being hydrogen powered, I think it's a very, very stance is nailed on it. Wheel cho choice is always personal, but I'm fine with the wheels. Enough chrome was left on it. The bed wood color works well with that interior. It's got a good stance, but it's not all tubbed out. I just really, you know, I dug the truck. And I walked by it the first time, first night I was in there because I thought that it was electric because it said zero emissions on it. And I was like, oh, it's a really cool truck, but I ain't shooting it, it's electric. And then I found out through Susan and through Mike that, hey, there's an alternative or something that nobody's talking about. It works just like gasoline, except for you make it from water and water comes out the tailpipe. So I'm gonna be a big fan of this, guys. I'm gonna get us all the information I can on it. I told Mike, get with me, let me know any information you wanna get out about this. When can we see it run? The tank was held up in customs that for this truck, so they couldn't run it there. They'd been running it on welding tanks, from my understanding. So that was the only issue with starting it and running it, but they are sure that they can make all this work. And I am so, so excited to bring it to you. And in the package of this 1948 Chevrolet 3100 pickup truck, I knew y'all would love that. Just beautifully done. Yeah, I think all involved, nailed it. And make sure you subscribe, ring the bell, do all that so that you can get all the information I can get on hydrogen power. So there you go from the 2021 SEMA show, a 1948 Chevrolet 3100 6.2 LS supercharged hydrogen powered pickup truck. Hope you all have enjoyed it. See ya!
Hey y'all, make sure you subscribe to this channel and visit scottydtv.com for an easy way to search the hundreds of videos I have posted. Either click the link in the description or the one at the end of this video.